Hello everybody and welcome to a new demo video. Uh, also a new series. Um, as you've read by the title, this is a registered users demo 01. Or also known as the registration user demo 01. Yeah. So, I figured I should say this at the start. I'm actually going into this blind. I have absolutely no idea what to expect from this disc. So, we're going to find out together. So, yeah. Let's see what we got. Oh wow. Oh okay, damn. Wow. Cool. Okay, well we'll go in the direction of the arrows. So we've got Broken Sword, Monster Trucks, Tomb Raider, Sentient, APSI 97, Two Extreme, Cool Borders, Destruction Dark Beats oh, okay, that might not work and it's a rolling demo. Life Force Tanker. Porsche Challenge and bloody hell, there's a fucking lot on here, isn't there? And Broken Sword, so Broken Sword was the first thing, so uh, yeah, let's get started, Broken Sword. Oh wow, okay. Got some controls. Action button, move, talk, move cursor quickly, okay. Simple. So yeah. I figured what's gonna happen is, um, the Euro Demo series will end in October. Uh, should things go the right way. So what I'm going to do, as I've got seven of these discs, and there were seven made, I believe, because number seven didn't appear to seem, it just didn't appear on any lists. So it was kind of like, well, uh, I guess there's seven of them. So it's like one, two, three, four, five, six, and eight. So yeah, I figure I've got seven of these discs. There's seven months before the actual series ends. So you've got April, May, uh, April, May, June, July, August, September, and then October, which is when the series will end, and that's seven discs that I can upload. So I'm going to upload a registered users demo once a month, basically, uh, to fill in some gaps, just because why not? And also, I'll still carry on doing any other demos that I have. Um, obviously, I'll list them all towards the end, but you can expect a new demo video I don't know when I'm exactly going to upload it, but I'm thinking probably on the last day of each month. And I feel like that'll be pretty damn cool. Um, so, yeah. We'll see We'll see what dates I select. I'm not really too sure what I'll do yet. But, yeah, I think I'm aiming to either more... of Because uh, obviously I've got to get one up in April. And obviously we're halfway through April at this current minute in time. Uh, oh, hang on. How do you select? Oh, square. Okay. Sorry, but yeah, no, I'll have to work out what day. I think it's most likely going to be on the last day of the month because it's easier that way, isn't it? So, uh, yeah, you can expect this at the start of every single, uh, well, at, well, at the end of every single month. The city holds many memories for me of cafes, of music. If I recall correctly, this is Broken Sword Shadows of the Templars. So we're going right back to 1995 here. Yeah, I was right, nice. I know Broken Soul is quite long, so I don't know how long we'll play this for.
Yeah, I remember the clown came in and put an explosive in there. The cafe blew up. Or the bistro. And, uh, yeah. We have to investigate, don't we? Right. I played this demo a long time ago, back in the very early Euro demos. As I picked myself up, all I could hear was the ceaseless drone of traffic. Life went on around me, but the explosion was to change my life forever. Indeed. Okay. I examined the jagged glass remaining in the window. It was broken, all right. Hmm. Right. Oh, uh, what button was it? I think it's square. Yeah. Did I drink? Oh, no. What is your name, Sherry? George Stobart, ma'am. Oh, American. She asked the question quite innocently, but I could sense her reserve. It was something which seemed to afflict all Europeans. You look like you could use a little help. I could use a little drink. I feel sick, dizzy, and bruised. I don't even remember the party. Just relax and take it easy. You've been knocked out. You don't say. What happened? There's been an explosion. You should try not to move. Are you a doctor? No, we're not a doctor. No, but I used to play hospitals when I was a kid. <laughs> Can you remember anything at all? No. I need a drink. Pour me a brandy. No. You could be in shock. No alcohol. What about the old man? Is he dead? I don't know. I haven't looked at him yet. Perhaps you should... Okay. Did you know the old man? No, monsieur. I never... Okay. Do you remember what happened when the clown entered? I remember that horrible tune he played all right. It was like a funeral dirge. I'd never like... Yeah. Stay here, mademoiselle. I'm... Look around for evidence. I think something there... I remember. I tried not to meet his stare as I searched the dead man's pockets. No wallet, no papers, no credit cards. The guy's past was a blank page. That's a shame, isn't it? Something to search there, hang on. I needed a stiff drink, but I hated the taste of brandy. A mysteriously undamaged bottle of spirit stood on the bar. Can I... What does triangle do? Oh, okay, let's do it. Alright, let's go back outside. Okay. The leading article referred to the visit of a Nobel Prize winner from some unpronounceable Eastern European state. That was the only news story. The rest was rumor, gossip, and sensationalism. Then I noticed the writing at the foot of the page. It read Salah ed 1345. Okay. I contemplated crawling under the umbrella and pretending none of this had ever happened. 
let's see what this guy had to say. Oh. Please, hold it right there. Whoa, don't shoot. I'm innocent. I'm an American. Can't make up your mind, huh? I demand to see the American consul. Drop your weapons and get down on the ground. Put that thing away, Sergeant Mu. I apologize, monsieur, but I cannot permit you to leave. Am I under arrest? Ah, uh, no. I would simply like to ask you some questions. En avant, to the café, marche. Yeah, I remember this, this guy came in. What a mess. This bombing is an outrage, is it not? Stop that, monsieur! Stop holding your breath at once! Has it occurred to you that he may be dead, Mo? <laughs> oui, monsieur, but I prefer to look on the bright side. Besides, I recall a case where the killer escaped by feigning death. Fair enough. However, in this case, the man is quite dead. Clearly, the killer knew of his presence and... How many times have I warned you about premature extrapolation? All we know is that he is dead. It seemed reasonable to assume... A great detective assumes nothing. Take Maigret, for instance. But, but he was a fictitious character, monsieur. Why, he was no more real than Poirot or Tatin. That's Tata. different, Tintin. Mou. They were comedy Belgians. Anyway, it is unlikely that even you will learn much from talking to the dead. Examine the girl and take her statement, if you can. Okay. Et maintenant, to business. Your name, please? George Stobart. I'm from California. And what brings you to Paris, Monsieur Stobart? Travel. I'm touring Europe. You chose well. The city is most beautiful at this time of year, no? Uh, yeah. I guess so. Apart from the bomb blasts. <laughs> Were you in the vicinity of the cafe at the time of the explosion? Yeah, I was sitting out on the sidewalk. I was lucky I wasn't killed. The inspector passed over my remark with no reaction. Did you see the deceased enter the cafe? Deceased? Yes. Yes, I did. Was he alone? Uh, yeah. And did he say anything to you? No. He was more interested in the waitress. Did you see anyone else in the cafe? We did not. Oh, wait, the clown, yes. Yeah, there was a guy dressed as a clown. He was carrying an accordion. An accordion? Bon, the picture is forming in my mind, and it is not a pretty one. Is the girl all right, Moo? She'll live. <laughs> Confirms the American She'll live. <laughs> A clown with an accordion, no doubt an elaborate and eccentric disguise. Very well. Eh bien, I have heard enough. What do you mean? I am satisfied that you know nothing. You may leave. I hope this little incident does not spoil the rest of your vacation. What about my personal safety? Can't you at least give me some advice? What can I say? Stay alert. And, and don't cross the road until the little man shows green. Great advice. I honestly believe you are in no danger, monsieur. Should you remember anything of importance, please contact me. My card.
Thanks. That is all. You may go. There's not much to go on, monsieur. On the surface, no. If the door can only be opened. Are you serious, monsieur? I thought your interest in psychic detection was purely academic. Academic? You are... Yeah, I forget if you hit square. Door. Oh. Who's this? Oh yeah, I remember. I think that she's a businesswoman. Excuse me, mademoiselle? Hi, my name's George Stobart. Oh, an American by the sound of it. Yeah, yep. that's right. On holiday in Paris. Some holiday, huh? You were here when the bomb went off? Sure was. Sat right out front of the cafe. Did you notice a middle-aged man, maybe 60, with an hat and overcoat? I couldn't believe it. She hadn't even asked how I was feeling. Yeah, he went inside, just before the bomb exploded. You weren't related to him, were you? Oh no, nothing like that. I am Nicole Collard from La Liberté. What's that, some kind of nightclub? Uh, no, it is a newspaper. You're a reporter? I'm a freelance photojournalist. Say, you can interview me about the bombing. You know, an eyewitness account. Minutes after the outrage that shook the whole of Paris. You know, real life drama, human interest, that kind of stuff. I'll just stick to the facts, thank you. Did you see who planted the bomb? I know it sounds crazy, but he was dressed like a clown. Oh God, it's him again. Him again? Uh, uh, sensitive controls, there you go. Have you met the clown before? It's a long story. I have plenty of time. I don't. <laughs> Who's the guy you were supposed to meet? His name was Planter. I didn't know him, but he called me last night. He said he had a story which would interest me. He asked me to m I guess I'll n well, Not unless you have Rosso's gift for psychic interrogation. Why won't you tell me about this clown? Why do you want to get involved? Because he almost killed me. Isn't that reason enough? I guess so. Listen, I'll give you my phone number. Okay. You help me with my story and I'll let you in on what I know. And let's get one thing straight right now. This is strictly business. Okay, it's a deal. I have to go develop these pictures. A bien trop, monsieur. I considered straightening the table, but I figured it best not to disturb the evidence. Yeah. Let's talk to this guy. Excuse me, Sergeant. You are the inspector. Go on, monsieur. I'm going to contact this guy. Look, Sergeant, the inspector... Yes, monsieur. He wants you to advise him if you have any information concerning this case. Well, I'd be glad to talk with him. But I don't want him working his psycho weirdness on me. Ah, no, monsieur. You're confusing the science of parapsychology with witchcraft. Oh, yeah? What's the difference? We don't do sacrifices. I've got Inspector Rosso's... Yes, monsieur. Did you find... No, sir. The inspector gave me specific instructions to guard this door. Until he countermands these orders or backup arrives, here I stay. I really did see the clown. He ran into the alley across the street. Did you follow him? That's your job, not mine. An arm chase through the streets of Paris? That's not our style, monsieur. Inspector Rosso may be unorthodox, but he's not crazy. How did you and Rosso arrive at the scene of the explosion so quickly? You arrived within minutes. Was it a tip-off? Inspector Rosso's sources are a perpetual mystery to me, monsieur. There are some who say he has made a pact with the devil. And what do you oh, think? Oh, no. I think he is 
the devil. What is Rosso? He is giving her the once over, as you Americans say. Huh? Once he gets his teeth into a case, nothing will shake him off. Was he serious about all that psycho detective stuff? Of course. Aspecta Ross. His revolutionary methods, once perfected, may change the face. I can't see it taking off in L.A. I was one of the last people to see the victim alive, Sergeant. Does that worry you? Yes, it does. I feel I kind of... I owe it to him to find his killer. That is best left to the authorities, monsieur. Did he speak to you? Tell you anything? No. He just grinned and nodded. Don't let it trouble you, monsieur. Go on and try to forget. I know the identity of the dead guy. His name was Plantau. Is that so? You knew him, did you? No, but... We'll know everything there is to know about him soon enough. I'm trying to be helpful here. The best way you can help us is to go home, monsieur. Okay, have the newspaper then. I found this. I found this in the street, Sergeant. That, monsieur, is a newspaper, no? There's a note written on it. Sala Edin, 1345. Ah, so the meeting with the clown was planned. How do you make that out? The time of the explosion was between half past one and two o'clock, n'est-ce pas? I guess so. But what about the name? Aha! That stumped you, hasn't it? I have never been stumped, as you put it, in my life, monsieur. It is the name assumed by the clown, no? Salah Eddin the Clown? I don't think so. Did I show you this newspaper? Yes, miss. Okay. See? Can I not actually get in there? Okay, let's... Let's go down the alley. Mm -hmm. I do have other demos to get to, so I probably won't be playing this for too much longer. Okay. I tried to lift the cover with my fingers, but couldn't gain any leverage. There was nothing of interest. Anything at all? Cat. Nothing around here then. Okay, let's go and talk to the miner. Because he was uh well he was outside that house, wasn't he? Or around the corner from the cafe. There like where is he? I'll use my cursor to show you. He was right he was sitting right there. And he's look he's mining right now, look. Okay, let's talk to this guy. Hi, can you spare a few minutes? I thought you'd been arrested! No, it was a misunderstanding. When he pulled that gun, gah, I thought that was it. Those automatics by quite a bunch, you know? He made a mistake. He thought I was a terrorist. You? A terrorist? Ha! He was only doing his duty, I guess. Let's ask him about the clown. Did you see a clown come by this way? 
A clown? Like in a circus? Yeah, with makeup and a big red nose. Ho! Oh, those guys are funny, aren't they? Not in my experience. I love the circus, especially the horses. You haven't answered my question. Have you seen a clown? You think I've got time to watch everyone who passes by? Some of us have to work for a living. Look, I know you're busy, but surely you'd have noticed a clown. I told you all. He was wearing multicolored baggy trousers and makeup. He'd be a poor sort of clown if he didn't. Listen, I have to find that clown. He's a killer. Say, who are you anyhow? A cop? No, of course not. A cop. I mean, do I look like a cop? <laughs> I guess not. How do you know this guy's a killer? Did you see him in action? Didn't you hear the explosion? The cafe was blown up. I wondered what that bang was. Any bodies? Yeah, an old man was killed. Nerd. I didn't think it was that serious. What about the waitress? Oh, she's fine. Thank the saints. Did you see an old guy with a briefcase? Wait, silly old coot. Do you know what he said to me? Work fascinates me, he says. I could watch it all day. Care bit. I could have knocked this block off. Fair enough. Did you... No. Should I have done? Was he a celebrity? No, but I guess he is now. His name was Plantar. Was he the one who died in the cafe? Yeah. That's too bad. Now I wish I hadn't called him what I did. If only I could turn back the clock. If only I'd been more tolerant. Regret and remorse are strange emotions. They really bring out the hammiest actors in people. Mm. They do indeed. Take a look at this. You told me you weren't a cop. Don't shout about it. I'm working undercover. Who are you looking for? That's confidential. Would you like to... I haven't got time to read that. Can't you see I'm busy? You could read it on your lunch break. Ten minutes is all I get. And if my boss had his way, I wouldn't get that. He'd have me on a drip, so I didn't have to stop to eat. Oh, take the newspaper and quit complaining. Bah! Look at these damn bleeding out liberals. Cha! Save the dolphins. Catch them and eat them, I say. All that fuss over a bunch of fish. Nah, that's more like it. Look at the size of those. Like champagne <laughs> bottle corks, no? Ah, what's this? Saladin running in the Prix de l'Arc de Triomphe. It's a racehorse? A horse? A legend. Bucephalus reborn, mon ami. Like a streak of lightning she is. Are you going to say anything impulsive? No. Do me a favor, won't you? Keep an eye on my hole. I'm off to put some money on that nag. Oh. Bye. Well. Let's see if we can get into here. The door was securely locked. Look after him. I wasn't going to head off all over Paris until I'd investigated some more. Okay. Well. There isn't really much else to investigate though, is there? I will have to quit soon because I do have other demos to get to, so. Five more minutes, Max. Excuse me, Sergeant. Please. I have. Oh. I've got Inspector Rock. Yes, I need to get in there. I don't know what else I can investigate.
Oh, I haven't quit. Yeah. There you go. I considered climbing the lamppost, but it wasn't going to shed any light on the affair. Wait. I considered climbing the lamppost, but it wasn't going to shed any light on the affair. I saw the car come. Oh, hang on. Yeah, no, we, we've been to that. I examined the jagged glass. No, we've done that. I examined. Yeah. I can. Yeah, you've done that. I mean, I don't know what else you can really investigate, can you? Let's go down the alley one more time. See if we just not missed anything. Brain to God, we haven't. Anything? It smelled like someone had dumped a truckload of fish in a locker room on a hot summer afternoon. Okay, I'm going to start select. Um, we made it as far as we did. But yeah, no, time and... Uh, it's beginning to get on, so we'll move on. Okay, next up is... Monster Trucks. And this is playable as well, that's pretty cool. Is it the early working demo, or is it the one where we actually race? That's the question. No, it's the one that we actually race on. Playable demo loading. Gasp. Bum, 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 bum.
that's the end. <laughs> Doesn't last long that one. Alright, here we go. Two Raider. Okay, that this is how you move. Look, walk. Shuffle right, shuffle there. Action, fire, go gun, go Okay. 36 minutes in, and we've only done. Well, this is the third game. This is. Uh, For the record, I don't know how long we'll spend on Team Road, but I suppose I've got to play through the demo. Now, I recall correctly, there is some animals that get me straight away. Now I know there was a thing in here, I think it was a bear, if I'm right. Killed him. Okay, we need to jump up here, because... There we go. So I know there was a health pack there. Give me the health pack. Now if I press... Oh no! Shit. Uh, okay, I thought square... Oh, I press select. Um... I'm gonna reset. I'm gonna go back in. I thought because I'm so used to select being the inventory opener usually. I forgot that one just ends bollocks. My fault. Well, actually, in fairness, I didn't know that it would end. So select doesn't help. Don't press select. It will end the game. See, never mind. Happens. Just don't hit select. Okay, that builds them. What? What the fuck happened there? Oh, fucking heck, are you serious? Come on. That time it wasn't even me. 
Maybe... Oh, I don't know. Try one more time. If it doesn't work, then we'll have to move on. It just freezes like that. What's the point? The hell? Okay, sorry about that. I really don't know why it keeps doing this. <sighs> what the hell? What the hell? Third time luck. Alright, third time lucky. If it freezes again, then we're moving on to Sentient. Alright, guns out. Seems like there's less of those wolves when they every time I boot up this demo. I'm not going to hit select. I might not even hit start for that matter, because I don't want to freeze the game again. Like I did in the first round of it. Don't freeze. Please don't freeze. Please don't freeze. Okay. No. Right, let's try this. No. No? Okay. There's a health pack there, I want it. Cheers. Oh. 
take it up as well. I remember there being something under here. Yeah, here it was. Shit. 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 Make it. Come on, you can make it. Oh, thank God for that. Oh, no. Get back up. There we go. Lovely. Right. Pick that up. Nice. What's this? Whatever they are. They clearly mean something, but I don't know what. Go through here. Okay. Oh. Climb out. And let's go. No. No? No. Oof. <laughs> so what the word... Door there, look. I reckon that opens. Ooh. Anything? No? Okay.
anything here? No. Shit. Anything in the pit? The answer is no. I fell. Okay. Wasn't this where I got trapped last time? I guess no longer. Okay. What's up here then? Oh no! Not <laughs> that way. Up we go. Oof. There we go. Is that all there was? Okay, so how the hell do I get out of here now? Okay. What the hell do you do now then? Maybe do I pull this out further? Unless... <laughs> yeah. And that's how you get through here. What do you reckon that is? Let's find out. What is it? Can we not pick that up? Okay, I guess not. Ooh. Okay, that's something. That needs to be picked up. Oh, picked up something. Nice. Looks like a totem of some sort. That's a key. Nice. The question is though, how do we actually get out of here? Oh, okay, I see. Okay, not like that. I need to get up there somehow. Um. Ah. Oh. Okay. Well, I've got what I need, so maybe. No, there's no way I can make it back up there, surely, right? Nah, I ain't making that. There's gotta be another way. Is 
They look like you can get up there, that's a the thing. Nah, you can't reach that. There's no way you can make that. Okay. Hold on. Anything here at all? No, that oh that looked like something a second ago, but no. Um at least the game didn't freeze this time round. But here's a problem, where do we go now? Okay, I had myself lined up there, hang on. Jump, you silly bitch! Oh. Oh, whoa, lovely. Okay. Dun 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 Oh no, I just missed. Oh, what are you supposed to do then? Hop, hoppity hop. What are you supposed to do then? Oh, come on, dude. Get up. Up you get. Oh, mate. Oh, hang on. Ah, ha ha ha, hang on. No, hang on. No, 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 no. no. Grab this. Okay. Bring this all the way through to here. Just keep bringing it. Okay, one more push. Okay, then climb up and then up to here. Ah, yeah, <laughs> nice. Oh, hang on. Okay. Ha ha. He solved the mystery. Down we go. Hey hey. Now. Let's see if we can now get through that door there. That'd be pretty cool, wouldn't it? If it doesn't, then I don't know what else to do. It froze. No, why now? No. No. Ah. Oh. So as soon as I press X, that, uh, that ended it. Oh, well, screw it then. Maybe that was the end. Maybe I don't have a clue. It just ended. We beat the demo, in my eyes. Maybe. Mate. If someone t tell me so if that was the end or not, I'm not convinced. But I pressed X. If that was the end, then happy days, because, uh... Well... 
pretty cool, right? All right. Sentient. Oh yeah, I think it was this game. We had to save the station, weren't we? But I had no idea what I was doing. I reckon we're probably going to end up blowing up the station again, but oh well. Yeah, the solar flare one. Okay. Right, well, we're going to put this on as easy it go as it can go. You want speech bubbles on. Okay. Alright, start game. A solar flare has hit the station. The shielding has been damaged. You only have 10 minutes to activate the shields before a second flare hits. And even if you manage that, there's only 15 minutes of oxygen left. So basically, you're fucked. <laughs> Be advised, level 7 solar flare has passed. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm advised. Be warned, life support to this deck is disabled. Estimated air supply, 15 minutes. Teleport access is disabled. Okay. Okay. Oh. Oh, keep it. Warning, 10 minutes to next slow the flare. Yeah, I know it won't survive, but let's be honest, we're going to lose anyway. Let's be clear. No. 
nice and something. Use it. The energy distribution console. Yeah, I know what it is. Can we use it then? Okay, okay. Get out of this room. How do we get out of this room? Well, that's what my credentials look like. See, that's the only thing I can use. Okay, let's use the radiation scanner. I'm using the radiation energy grid. It's the only option I have to select. And I... No. Okay. Uh, what do I do? I mean, am I stupid? There's... No... Nout... I've done that. Radiation use. Okay, that's useless. That's the only thing I can select. There's no green square anywhere else. No. Why the door? Can I get out the door? Help, 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 help. I'm gonna die in ten minutes. Um. I think we're kind of fucked. Maybe if I try and use my credentials to get into the computer? Maybe. I'll bring up the menu. Examine, read, drop. Oh crap, no. Oh. Hello. Minic, I need your help. The particle decelerator unit in the. Uh, yeah, okay. Hey. The teleport's knackered. Ah. I need an electrical kit. Does you have access? I 
can't remember what he said. I don't really know what I'm doing. Yeah, please do that. Why? So the teleport is fixed. Well, where do I go to sit to oh, I can't remember what he said now. Um No uh Right, give a command. Lead me to. Where's the teleportation room? Medic. Guy. Guy. I need to, uh, special. Not available. I'm doing my best with this, I don't really know what I'm going. Make a statement. I has the status of <laughs> very ill. I am seriously ill. Um give me a command. I don't really know what I'm doing. Lead me to Why not? What am I supposed to I can't remember what he said to do. No. Uh oh don't push me. <laughs> you are gonna lead me to The airlock. Ah. Oh. Well, fuck you then. Lumps well, to go and explore. Not really much else I can do, is there? Hello. Got it. Look, I need some help here. I need a mechanical repair kit to override this locking mechanism. But if I leave it unattended, the emergency belt will lock down the room for good. Rodney. You. I need to find Rodney. Rodney. Where'd he go? Oh, he's there. Hello, you. Give me a command. Need me to Rodney, person. I need to find... Where are you? 
Rodney, Rodney, Rodney. Where is Rodney? Ah. Not right now, medic, but I'll take care of it. No! We're gonna die because of you now. Where is Rodney? I need an electrical mechanical kit. But I can't find it. And I think the whole world's gonna die. Yay. This whole station's going in to be hit by a sun, uh, sun flare. Solar flare. Whatever you fucking call it. Can we not proceed this way? Oh, well. We're fucked. Oh dear. Oh dear. 20 points! Woo! Yeah, not a fan of that game. Pretty, <laughs> not the greatest thing I've ever played. Let's be real. Well, what ifs? Okay, what we got next? ASPI ninety-seven. Is this a football game? Yes, so. Oh, Adidas Power Soccer International. Oh, it is a soccer game. Set at the bottom. It's Adidas Power Soccer. Or Adidas Power Soccer. Bluefield. Um, okay. No. Nope. How many yellow cards do you reckon we get today? The record was eleven and one red card. That's currently counted by oh well. I counted the, the uh, some of the viewers in my previous videos counted it out for me when I had that many cards. It was really hilarious. No, Joe, must thank that guy. Cheers for doing that for me. Dude! What the fuck? That's gonna be a bloody one, isn't it? No, it's not. No yellow. Oh. I've got the ball. I've got the ball. I've got the ball. I've got the ball. I'm going all the way. He's going all the way. He fouled me. That's gonna be a kick in it. Yeah. I'm gonna shoot. Pow. Boom. Oh, that's a shame. Oh well. <laughs> oh mate. Oh, tackle. Yeah, take that. <laughs> Is this referee not giving out yellow cards? Oh, oops, wrong way. No, get the ball, you... Oh, Jesus. We'll do a long pass. Oh, it's square, let's try and do it. That is not a long pass. I'm just going to stand by, don't you? No. Oh. Come on, that's got to be a penalty, surely. Yeah, I thought so. No way did that go over. Are you serious right now? Oh, wow. Oh, I've got a yellow.
come off it. Oh yeah. <laughs> That's how things work, isn't it? Wow. Bang. Okay. No! Oh. No! <laughs> oh, give me that ball. Bastard. Oh, I'm lo I lose. No? Okay, still going. I lose. Oh, okay. Die. He's in. He's in. Go on, ball. Go on, mate. Go on. Boom! Oh, that's my only chance. Ooh, eerie sound. Sorry. Sorry about that. Um, come close. <laughs> One nil. Okay. Two extreme. Okay. What's too extreme then? Because I have no idea. Have you played this before? Yes, we have played this before. Three miles an hour, then. Ah. Oh. That was the end. Two minutes and five seconds. Eighth place. Hmm. Could be worse, can it? Yeah, we played that game before. I recognise it. Cool borders. 
This is a non-playable demo. Oh, okay. So this is a video, or a rolling demo. Hopefully Destruction Derby 2 is, because I don't think it works on PS3. The rolling demo does, but not anything else. Web system. Web system. So we're watching the whole replay again. I think that was it. Yeah. Okay. Moving on. I think there's only one or two things left. Um. What we got left? Touch and Derby two. Oh. Oh no. Um. We got three things left. Okay. Touch and Derby two. Okay. This is playable.
I'm expecting the PlayStation to crash here. It's already done it. It's already done it. It's already done it. Fuck! I knew it would do it. I told you, yeah, Destruction Derby 2 does not work. I didn't think it would. Ah. Crap. Okay, back in the mo, peeps. Let's crash. Okay, we're back. Sorry, guys. Um. Yeah, we won't do Destruction Derby 2 again, because, as predicted, I thought it would crash the system, and it did just that, so, yeah. Sorry, guys, we do have something that doesn't work, which is sucky, sucky, sucky. Um, but, oh well. Fuck it. On to Life Force Tanker, I think the next one was. Yeah, Life Force Tanker. Alright. And this is a game that I don't really 100% like either, because it's just so easy to die. You always die from that bomb. You get a timer on the top of your screen, and next thing you know, oh, and then you're gone. It's probably going to be the same result here, let's be real. <laughs> I just know it's going to happen. Oh, oh. Diagnosis. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's all I know what's going to happen. Oh, look, there's that timer. Alright, we're dead in the next few seconds, so uh, cheers for playing, guys. Ooh, no, don't go that way. We're gonna die very, very shortly. Yep, there he goes. <laughs> He's just it. Yeah, I don't get it. I really don't. Oh, every time. Okay, next up, oh, final thing on the disc: Porsche Challenge, featuring the Porsche Boxster. Yeah. The Porsche Boxster! We're gonna win the Porsche Boxster! What do you reckon it says it in the game? Let's hope it does. I want that to be the meme.
Okay. Suck. Oh well, there you go. Oi! Okay, so don't warrant an oi when I go slamming into the side of you, but a little bash on the side. Oi! That's the end. Okay, I can't actually uh, reset the demo. Lovely. So I select doesn't work. But okay, never mind. Okay, that was the registered users demo 01. Um, solid demo disc though, isn't it? It's not too bad. Um, 
got some of those classic games on there that we've played in the past. So, you know. Mm. Nice to go back, really, wasn't it? And just play some games that were around in the early demos. Um, so, yeah, here's what I decided. Um, I'm going to upload this one straight away, so you guys will be able to view this one instantly. And then on the first of every month, I will upload or release a new registered users demo. Instead of doing it at the end, because, yeah, I think it'd be nice to have it on the start of the month. So yeah, Broken Sword, solid game. Monster Trucks, Tomb Raider, solid game. Sentient. Action Power Soccer, yeah, it's alright. Too extreme, fun. Four Borders, decent series. Destruction Derby 2, much better than the original boss, so we can't see that because we can't play the game. Life Force Tanker, ooh, and Porsche Challenge, there you go. Not bad. So yeah, pretty solid demo disc. Uh, so yeah, that's about it. Uh, thank you very much for watching. Take a good... Oh, what was that? Oh my god. Take a good what? Uh, have a good night. Take a good night. Do whatever you need to do to have a good night. And uh, yeah, that's it from me. Take care.